everyone, it's Melissa here to plan in my Free Spirit Classic Happy Planner. So it's February, brand new color scheme, nice and pink. What I wanted to do, actually I've been wanting to do this for a few weeks now, is to do um, a sugar and spice spread. Now this is not, I got most of my stickers, or I will be getting most of my stickers from this book. This, this sticker is not. It's from another book, one of the tiny sticker books. And um, I've been putting kind of double box stickers on this side, so I thought I would switch things up and then put this one here. Actually, what I should probably do is lay out how I'm going to want these little row of stickers. Now, I think, I was thinking about this, what I think I will do is have one half of it on this row and then the other one over here. Let me just lay this down. Okay, as straight as I can, of course. Okay. And I will just take my handy little finger knife and cut this off. Let me put my ruler down so it doesn't go there. And just gonna use this. Okay. There we go. And I might I don't know if I'm going to use that, but let's just leave that over to the side and I'm going to use the other one. No, I'm probably gonna save that knowing me. Put this one here. Okay. Across the way here. Okay. Make sure it's as high up as I can. Let me take this again. Let me rest that along there so it doesn't go into the other page. Take my little finger scissors, put it right up against the edge, and cut gently but firmly so it comes off like that. I really like using these two box stickers. Um, generally, I'm really happy to be uh, planning vertically again. So I'm going to go ahead and put this here. Okay. Love it. Now what I usually like to do is for there to be a box sticker on every single row. So um, there's already one here, then I'm going to put one in the middle and then one at the bottom. I'm trying to figure out where I'm going to put this really pretty quote kind of I'm thinking in the middle here hmm I don't know if I'm ready to commit where to put that <laughs> so tragedy has struck unfortunately in this sticker book because these pages <laughs> are falling apart that's not good um yeah, so I'm going to have to, I'm, I'm, I might glue it, or I might just really just make sure that I use that, um, this elastic, but I will just go ahead. I really wanted to use this. Um, I am a <laughs> big sticker hoarder, so part of me never wants to use this floral, like I'm having second thoughts using it now. Okay, I might actually just not use it, because I feel like, do these pink florals go together with this? But is that just me trying not to use a floral? I might just use one of these so I can at least try to tie in that yellow. You know what? I'm just going to go for it. I'm going to layer a box sticker on top of it. If I can just lay it down straight. I don't normally do this. I don't lay it right in the box, but Let's give that a go this week. And I'm going to just stick a box sticker there so I can 
ground that floral a little bit. I know that there's a giant stack of these. Just looking for the coral one. Is there a coral one? If not, I can just dig into, use this one. And then maybe stick a yellow header. Is there a yellow header? There is on top of it. I just don't, you don't wanna color, cover up these florals. They're just so pretty. So let me use this yellow header like so. And I like that little layer there. Maybe I will use one of these and one of these in the spread this week. Okay. I love this sticker book, but I kind of knew that this would happen. These elastics really, they don't necessarily hold up too well. I need to start incorporating some yellow here. So I'm gonna put this down here. And then I'll put this one on the weekend, maybe on Sunday. So what I like to do is for there to be two functional boxes, I feel like, should I just commit and stick that there? I'm not ready. <laughs> I'm really not ready. Okay, to add some of these glasses. Maybe I'll put this under Don't Forget. I like that, that's cute. And I think I'm going to take the edge of this and just have it peeking out from underneath. I just, I can't even believe I'm using both of these florals. I'm a little sad, not gonna lie. So if I stick half of it coming out like this, I think that'll work. Like so. Am I going to have to sacrifice a leaf? I think I might have to. Yes, but I will save it because I will use you some other time. Put that there. And I'll put this right along here. I might actually use that leaf now. Okay. Let's see if it can fit. Um, yeah, it can. I'll just lose this small bit of the leaf. This one I can chuck, and then this one I can just tuck back in here, like so. Oh, that's super cute. I'm really happy with that. I'm still not really using my sidebar. I guess my needs for this planner are changing with how functional the uh, dashboard layout is for my minis. So, um, yeah, I find that I don't necessarily need this so much for a lot of functionality. Maybe I can put this wild at heart. I know I'm just gonna have to commit and start sticking some of these quotes. It's just hard. It is just hard. Okay. And I wanna keep adding yellow to this side because there's not a lot of it. I'll stick the other half of the floral going this way. Yes, I think that I will do that. Okay. I'm kind of wanting to white out this line. But when I do that, I don't really like the look of it after, but I think I will this time anyway. I might use this post-it tape to just do maybe the middle of the floral. Just cutting it really thinly into strips. And I'm just going to lay it just so that it covers the line under and cut another little strip, put that down here. Okay, maybe cut this in half a little bit. And then 
cut it in half again for this side. Okay, let me take this knife off and I'll stick this down. Do I like this? I do, I do. I like that I did that. Now, yeah, so there's two functional boxes, roughly two functional boxes here. I definitely don't need, so this is functional, this is gonna be functional. I'll just probably add bullet points later so I can decorate this with something. Um, just wondering if I should add another box sticker or if I should add a quote. I'm really proud of myself for using those florals, <laughs> to be honest. Um, I'm just gonna go for it and just really use all of my stickers. So let me just offset this one just a little bit. And I'm happy with this side. I can move on over here. Maybe I can put the every moment matters on this corner. I'm just not ready to give that up. <laughs> So there is a box in the top, the middle, and at the bottom. So I should refrain from doing that, maybe. I know I haven't added my glasses, these glasses. So I think maybe I will. Let me use this just kind of bisecting and in the middle. And I'll just go ahead and use these. These all look cute. And then I can write in there. So lots of functionality here. I think I'm going to use this as functionality and then maybe this one can be more decorative. I'm going to use this one. What's on this other side? It is two quotes, but they're clear and then a matte sticker right beside it. I like that. So this is functional. I'm writing in here so I can maybe put some sort of decoration on this side. Should I just commit and stick this here? I really should, right? It's hard, okay. <laughs> I'm not ready. I haven't used all of these paper clips, so let me use these ones here. Right, because there's already a yellow paper clip at the top row here. Okay, I always try to kind of look at them side by side so I can figure out what it needs. I'm liking this, so this day is done. This day, I need to figure out what I'm gonna put in here. Maybe I will just put the quote on. This is functional. I need two functional boxes for the weekend. I've already put the wild at heart. Let me maybe put, what a wonderful day. Okay. Maybe I should just put some more boxes. I really like this too. Or should I just commit and stick that quote there? Or maybe I'll stick it in the middle. Hmm. I'll put it at the end. You know what? I think I'm ready to commit. Oh, I'm not. Okay. Hmm. If I stick it along the middle here, that's gonna be okay. I think I'll do that. Yes, I want that to be able to shine on its own. Second guessing, not putting any sort of tape in the middle here. So I'm going to put a pair of scissors, are these down? Hopefully to weigh it down, weigh it down, nope. Okay, then I'm going to stick one of these on the line and hopefully, oh, that'll do. Love it. I just don't want any line through this floral. I know. <laughs> okay, so two functional boxes. I can just maybe stick some sort of bullet points. Let me try bringing some yellow ones from the back here, these. Now I'm gonna have to put some on this side too. I just wanna add some more yellow to this spread. Some pretty yellow bullet points. 
I don't want to put the same one. Maybe I'll put a flag. Yes, I'll put a flag right here. A yellow flag. Okay, this side's definitely done. Stick a coral flag down. Okay, I cover this up so those two are functional. Maybe I'll do that. And like so. So I pulled out two of these pen stickers. No, I only pulled out one. <laughs> Anyways, add some coral flags. Coral bullet points, maybe. Is there coral bullet points? There's a pink. Is that pink and orange? Okay, maybe not. But maybe I'll add some of this teal. Yeah. And... I think that about finishes the spread. I'm so proud of myself for using so many florals. I usually hoard them and then new sticker books come and I still can't even really use those. So I'm liking this, yes. I think maybe I should have used a flag for this. I just didn't want two of these side by side. Oh, this is really sticky. Let me just make that one little change and I am good. I like this, that's pretty. And then maybe I'll put another yellow one here. Okay. And I love it. Yes, that's cute. Thank you so much for taking time to watch this video. I truly do appreciate it. If you like this video, I hope you'll click like. To not miss any of my videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Thank you so much.